Alright, welcome guys. In today's video, in this video, I'm going to talk about how pipes work, how power producers work, how batteries work, and how poles work. Electric poles. Alright, let's start with pipes. This is a pretty simple concept, but can get complicated. So this is the short pipe. It just goes in one direction. And it's automatically hooked forward. The second type of pipe, the second version, is a pipe section. This is pretty important because you can connect them in different ways, like this. This is like an intersection, like its name, actually not a section. So you can arrange them. So this goes here and it goes up. It's pretty handy. The next type variant is a pipe turn. This is pretty self-explanatory. It's a turn. But this time you have to hook it up if with another of these other pipes. You have to hook up the pipe section, pipe turn, and pipe junction. Like this. The pipe junction is just a narrow, one less output than the pipe section for all your neater needs. And to connect all these pipes, for example, let's make a pipe system. Let's put a roller, I don't know. A uh, and drill. This doesn't actually do anything, but this is for the example. So you see here the pipes you have to connect with this tool, you have to connect it to the input and the output. So I could. Like this. You can connect it to this yellow part, and then the output, you connect it to that part. So now we have a problem. How do we connect it? Well, there's different ways. You can use a pipe section, a pipe turn, or a pipe junction. Pipe, t pipe turns is like a neater way to pr present pipes so it's less confusion. And now there's a second variant, the water one. It works exactly the same, it just can only work with water and water inputs. So when you see a cylinder, this is the output of water, and a red cylinder, that means it's liquid. I'm going to show you another example using the pipe tool. So let's say... You need this turn, but it's not flowing. So you gotta kind of first press the one that you want, and then press it where you want it to go. I want it to go to the right, and then I want to go to the left. And you connect it. The next thing is power producers. There's lot lots of different types. Steam turbines is an odd one. For example, solar panels, they produce power. And you can see on the back how much they produce per solar panel. And I'm going to use a battery. You should really use batteries like this. Since it really simplifies it and s distributes it evenly. Alright, so now... We have faced another problem. How do we get the power to the battery to the drills? Well, you use a wire tool. So you click the power source and you select it where you want it to go. So, so it's a battery. We just you can also use shift to select multiple things. Boom boom boom. 
And now, you can just see it's building power from all these evenly. So let's connect it. Boom. And see, it's, it works. Alright. The trash tool is pretty self explanatory. You can drag and select the area. For quick, you just have a bunch of these. You just want to get rid of it. Just drag it and select it. Like that. And you can, or you can double tap. So you just double click or double tap on an object. Alright. This is the power pole. Power pole is like a transport. You can use it for batteries for like a steam turbine. This is the weak version. There's upgraded versions of all these. So you you connect the power battery or power source. And there's in the basic one there's two colors. In the max version there's four colors. So it evenly distributes it to these. I don't have any power in it right now. Let me show you. I'm gonna use a, a better power source, a wind turbine. See, it's getting power, and we can connect these. It can only connect to the respective color, so red cannot connect with blue. It gets power, but when I try to connect it there, it doesn't work. Only with red. This can be handy, so for traveling long distances. But this could be, you just put some, you know, cold drills along the way, like this, and then you can evenly. It's useful traveling power. Alright, now we're going to talk about the research icon. Which uses research points. I'll show you how to get it later. So here's where you research all these items that you can use in your factories. And will use. Alright, so first... This is a renewable power energy and batteries. Rusty battery, MV battery, all of them. Geothermal plant, solar powers, so solar panels, and wind turbines. The next category is fossils. This includes boilers, drills, pumps, oil, and all that good stuff. Now for utility. This is pretty helpful. Transportation. This is how you sell this stuff. Vanity port. This is the LV pole. The electric pole. That I showed you. This is the LV pole. And the research is scrubber. Which I'll talk about in another video. Research station 2. I'll talk about that later. And better item pipes and better fluid pipes. Alright, let's talk about research. So how you get research points are you have to use you gotta go to MISC. Research station 1 or 2. Research 2 makes a lot more research points. These are how to get more research points to unlock more stuff. So all these things, these only need power. So you could use solar panels and a battery. I'm going to use the upgraded versions. This is NV battery. So these things need a lot of power. But they produce some. Let me get my solar panels. I'm going to demonstrate how much you need for three. Let's 
should start with these. Ten solar panels. So you just go to the batteries. The batteries do all do the same thing, they just hold different capacity. So when they glow like this, they're producing some. And when it stops glowing, you get the points. And since these are not turning on, it's because we don't have enough power. So these things need a lot. I missed one. So that's how you get research points. Alright, that's everything. There's upgraded versions in the third category. These things work exactly the same. I'll talk about pipe intersections in another video. These, these upgraded pipes just flow fast, faster and have more capacity. And the poles. This one can contain more vol voltage and go farther. So they're just upgrades. These are the basics. Alright. Bye guys. I'll see you in another video.